My name is Roberto Lanza. I'm the technical responsible officer for the cranes in the ITER assembly building. Two girders of the crane that will be used for the lifting and assembly of ITER components have now come to Marseille. Each girder is more than 46 meters in length, with overall cross dimensions of 4 meters by 3.5 with a weight of approximately 200 tons. The ITER components will be assembled with the help of these two powerful bridge cranes manufactured by the consortium NKM, NERL and REL. The first girder has been unloaded from the vessel and loaded onto a barge to cross the canal. Then it will be transferred to a trailer for the road transportation. Due to its exceptional weight and size, a special convoy will cross the south of France to deliver the girder to the ITER construction site. My name is Ben Slay. I am FRE's coordinator for the transportation and logistics of all ITER components. The convoy transporting the girders is the biggest ever to date. The operation has been financed by Fusion for Energy and is managed by DAHER that is responsible for the logistics and transportation of ITER components. The operation has been carried out at night following a specific route which has been developed by the French authorities. It's driving slowly at 2 to 5 km per hour, covering a distance of 104 km. The transport of ITER components requires good communication and coordination between all the parties involved so that we respect the tight schedule and avoid causing any disturbance to the local population. This is the last and fourth night that the convoy has traveled and when reaching the ITER site this marks the delivery of the first European heavy exceptional component. Two smaller pieces will be delivered later this year and when they are connected this will form the crane that will be lifted 60 meters above the ground into the assembly hopper.